What's up, everybody? Your host, AMF1534, here, and let's play some more Condemned Criminal Origins. And we have one more. One more thing left to find. In our previous installments, we have been looking through this house through these strange trails of... In, of uh, I wouldn't call... That's not infrared. I don't remember the... It's um, UV. Yeah, UV written text of origin I cannot really recall what it is and uh, now we're going to do good gravy it's apparently super foggy outside um, we gotta follow this trail here and that will lead us to the last part of this puzzle hopefully it doesn't get us killed um, for, let me run down another thing for you here besides the fact that I have an email um, each one of these little things when you run to the end of it gives you part of like a like a riddle well, not really much of a riddle but more kind of like a kind of like a puzzle sort of flip the light switch I don't need to flip the light switch I need to follow this across the counter open the door. oh boy beyond which you it says nothing coming flying in here like last time is there good excellent Indeed. Dark path to righteousness is beyond which you see yourself to be. The question now is where do we go? I'm wondering if we have to go back down here. I guess we're about to find out now, aren't we? Now let me give you a very... Holy God! Let me give you a very vital piece of information, by the way, regarding my LPs. Um, I have found parts of the issue upon what I was struggling with with my lag issues um, I found out that from one of my viewers that what in the no way that's ridiculous okay um, I have downloaded a new version of fraps um, it's not the one that's actually supposed to be released saying that all the desync issues are going to be changed it's actually the version right before that one, but the new one actually is not available for me to get yet. Oh boy. Those look like pictures of me. So do these. Oh, great. So, we're very, very close to having uh, desync free videos. Yes! It looks like it's about me. seem more to it than that. Oh boy. There's some serious, serious shit going on upstairs and I don't know if I want to be a part of it. Unless we have the guns. The Peter guns to take care of it with. Got like sound recording stuff and a really weird place to have a bed. Um, huh. But yeah, anyways, like I was saying, we're actually very, very close to having uh, desync free videos. Whenever the time may be that we get a uh, free version of Fraps. Ooh, there's a metal piece. Awesome. I don't. I do not know what spurred my interest to go over there and look for that, but nonetheless, we have it. And I think we actually almost have all the birds too. So this is going to be good. But now we have some things to investigate up here. And I. Oh wow. What a bloody mess. That table even got flipped over. Man, this place just got worked to shit. Somebody got... Must have gotten thrown out the window. Or something. 
You wanna go out the window? Still can't go through that door. Maybe if we investigate a little bit going this way. God, please! I huh? can't take this anymore! My ears! My hands! What in the... Who was just talking? I didn't even see anybody. Oh boy. I just saw somebody running up to the front door. Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. Find an axe to cut free the piano and continue searching upstairs. Where's... Where the hell's the axe? I didn't see an axe. Oh. Oh, I need an axe. Okay, that, that makes sense. Um, where was the last place we had an axe? God damn it. I don't remember the last place I had an axe. Ugh! These guys. Come on, bring it on, I dare ya. I got a gun and you don't! That guy has a shovel. Oh wow, this thing was full when we got it. That's really nice. There's a, there's a sledgehammer there. That's... Not very helpful, though. Hey! Ooh, there's a crowbar. Awesome. Um, I don't recall anybody coming from there. Um, let's take this crowbar. I actually know where we can use that. That'll be good. Um, we need to go back in the other room out in front. My battery is really low on my phone, and that's very counterproductive. Here we go. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Yeah, we got... That was funny. There we go. Hey! God, we have like everybody coming in here right now. No bueno. God, we got machine guns and shotguns and the whole nine. Um, but the problem is, is where is a fire axe? I'm in dire, dire need of one of those. Wherever one can be provided, I would love to have it. Who's flopping in here now? I'm gonna guess that maybe one of these guys might have one. I would severely hope so, because I really need one. There's not one there. Oh, crap. Can't climb outside. Nothing there. I guess I'm gonna continue doing this little... Hmm. I'm gonna continue doing this little back and forth movement here until I can find myself a fire axe, which I'm gonna take a random shot at the fact that it might be in the basement. Maybe I left one down there, because I... Re God, too many people. It's ridiculous. Got a gas pipe. There's gotta be one around here somewhere. There's just no way. <laughs> Uh. Oh, great. I'm stuck. Huh. Okay, somebody at some point is going to have to have a damn fire axe. Because obviously they're not letting me go downstairs. It's like they're making me run a gauntlet or something to get it. Eh, get the hell out of here. Um. Cut railing with... The I can't do that, because I don't have an axe, damn it. He's got it. The smallest guy had to have it. Good gravy. Okay, here we go. Use the fire axe. Awesome. Alright, now we're going to push the damn thing off of here, I'm sure. There we go. Yeah, baby. Okay, well, before we're going upstairs, I'm going to make sure we get our health up a little. I don't trust any of this crap. Okay. Time to f follow whoever was going up this way. Even though I don't know exactly what room they were in when they were here. My guess would be maybe we're going back to the attic again? Or something. Maybe not. Oh god, we have to go back into the child's room? I don't like going in the child's room. Ugh. We're not going back in there, are we? Good, we're not. Um, I don't think there was anything in here for us, either. 
Well, where in the blue blazes am I supposed to go? Maybe in here? Nope, not in there. Probably a good thing. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, what in the world? What is he doing? That guy's... Oh, my God. Who the hell is this? Uh... So he impaled himself with a fireplace poker. That's a new one. Um, I'm almost positive. I've got the green right here. Why are you not letting me? Well, what the hell? I don't really know where, where else I'm supposed to go. I can see the green on his hands. There we go. Gosh, I was just like, why aren't you letting me do this? There we go. Christ, it looks like serial killer X got to him, painted him up, tortured him, drove him to suicide, just like Anderson did to his victims. To Rosa, we're this close to getting the guy. I don't know what poor innocent schmuck you're chasing, but stop it now. Come into the bureau, give yourself up, and we'll talk. There are things we need to discuss. I can't do it, Farrell. Then play it your way, but we'll find you. Count on it. Looks like you're on your own, Thomas. Oh boy, Carl. Carl. Oh no, oh, Mr. Torturer. Don't, Don't you want, want to know, to know what, what it feels like? like? We're, We're not, not even, even half done. done. Carl. You, you know, know how this will end. I was put on this earth to bring you to justice. Your fate is in my hands. Oh, wow. This is gonna get nasty. Oh, Carl. You've given up. Wait for it. It's a shame. Wait for it. Now, perhaps you know what you have put others through. Oh, what makes you even more pathetic than that you weren't brave enough to kill yourself. Now I'll have to do the job. And, and make it look right. It's so sad. Now! <sighs> you shouldn't have come here. Oh, no you don't. You're not going to keep... I know exactly what you're trying to do, you sick bastard. You think I'm... <laughs> yeah, I won't be able to win this battle if I don't have any fucking run in my meter. Did I just run in a complete circle? I'm just gonna go the other way. Don't tell me what I am, Mr. Man. You're hiding in one of these rooms, I know it. Because you're not going downstairs and neither am I. So I will find you. Oh no you don't. I'm gonna catch you, you little fucker. Get back here. Once I can get my run meter back up, I'm gonna get you. Come out, Mr. Serial Killer. Come out and play, yay. I've got a fireplace poker, and he wants to say hello. <laughs> Where are you? You can't hide from me forever. I was put on this earth to bring you justice, Mr. Man. But I gotta... I gotta give him some credit, though. This guy can move. He is very good at playing 
the elusive man. There we go. Uh-oh. What the hell's going on? What in the... Van Horn? Did you just... You little bastard. Leland! Nephew, please listen to me. I am here to help. You are not yourself. You are not in your right mind. Let me help you. I know of what I speak. I... Uh-oh. Oh, crap. <laughs> this is getting real, real quick. So that guy... Serial Killer X is Van Horn's nephew? Oh, God. Internal report number 779. The governor, citing outside direction, has given command of the city's escalating crime problems to federal agencies. When questioned about the specific agencies involved by local press, no department names were forthcoming. This has left many to wonder if these phenomena are contained locally or are actually posing a national threat. Uh-oh. Welcome to consciousness, my friend. Though you won't enjoy it long. <sighs> we were good in the beginning. But you turned out to be kind of a failure, didn't you? <laughs> you still don't get it? I've been using you, Ethan Thomas. <laughs> I watched you, and followed you, and used you to find the serial killers you so desperately sought, and then kill them. Okay, I must admit, I was a bit dramatic. Kill them the same way they killed their own victims. <laughs> a bit of fun, you know. <laughs> I got good at it. Shame it ruined you at the bureau. But some things are unavoidable. Of course, since you're no longer going to be any help, there's no reason to go on this way. How would you prefer to die? I didn't like the torturer's methods much. Too risky. Perhaps a slit across the throat, like the roadside carver. Ah, short and sweet. Or maybe the bone cutter. Neatly dissected the body, removed the internal organs, and labeled them for the police to find. Oh, yes, he was one of mine, too. Oh, he was so close Who the hell's that guy up there? But I got there first. Perhaps it would be better if he forced <laughs> It has caused all this madness. Go, kill it now. Kill what? Uh, all right. Well, apparently we need to hunt down and destroy the one responsible for all the madness. But unfortunately, we don't have time to do it right now. So, when we come back on the next episode of Let's Play Condemn Criminal Origins, we're gonna try to find our way out of here and escape. So, this is your host AMF1534 saying thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one. Bye.